How to care for a rabbit. Part 5. Keeping your rabbit healthy. 1. Clean the cage every week. Make sure the bunny is under supervision while you work. Empty the dirty hay or shavings from the cage, wash it with hot, soapy water, rinse it thoroughly, and let it dry. Fill it with clean hay or shavings. You should wash out the water dish or bottle every day. The litter box needs to be changed out every day, and thoroughly disinfected every week or so with a 10% white vinegar solution. Rinse well and allow to dry. If the litter box is plastic or metal, you can also place it in the dishwasher. Have more than one litter box, so that you can switch a clean one while the other box is dirty or in the process of being cleaned. Rabbit urine is very alkaline and crystals can build up on the surface of the litter box and require the use of a descaling solution. 2. Keep the temperature right for your rabbit. Optimum temperature for rabbits is 61 to 72 degree Fahrenheit. If your rabbit is outside, provide plenty of shade and, if it gets really hot, bring them indoors to air conditioning or place frozen water bottles in the hutch to help the rabbit keep cool. Rabbits can die of heat stroke. The rabbit's ears are really the main temperature control part of their bodies. If they were in the wild, the rabbit would go underground where it is cool to get out of the heat. 3. Brush the rabbit. Bathing should never be done, but you can use a soft bristled brush to carefully remove hair every day or two. If you have two rabbits, you may notice them grooming each other. Rabbits do not need to be bathed unless they get very dirty and are not able to groom themselves properly. 4. Take the rabbit to the veterinarian at least once a year. Rabbits need annual checkups to make sure they're healthy. Many veterinarians who treat cats and dogs do not have expertise in treating bunnies, so you may need to find a vet who treats exotic animals. Depending on where you live, your veterinarian may recommend vaccination for certain diseases like myxomatosis if you live in the United Kingdom. In the United States, myxomatosis vaccination is not currently recommended. Your veterinarian will do an examination and discuss their findings and make recommendations based on your rabbit's current condition. Managing healthy dentition in rabbits may require anesthesia to fully examine the teeth and address any sharp points discovered on the back teeth premolas and molars. 5. Learn how to read rabbit body language. Knowing how your rabbit is feeling is extremely important if you want your bunny to be happy and healthy. If a rabbit's ears are flat on its back, its eyes are bulging and its body is tense and hunched up, it is scared. If a rabbit is really terrified, it may be trembling and breathing heavily. If a rabbit is very relaxed chilled out, it will be laying stretched out with its front paws in front of it, or it may have all its paws tucked beneath its body. It may also be laying on its side. Its ears may be flat on its back. Sometimes, when a rabbit is extremely happy and excited, it will jump into the air and flick its body. This is called a binky. Many rabbits will run around very quickly before binkying. Sometimes, if a rabbit is feeling lazy, it won't do a proper binky, but will remain on the ground and do a sort of shuddery flick. Thanks for watching. And please don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. See you in our next upcoming video.